There's a lot you can miss in highlights. Lots of great basketball in this area with stories to be told. We go beyond the highlights with the Pinckneyville Panthers. In Pinckneyville, there's a love for basketball that starts at a young age. The little kids high-fiving us at the tunnel is definitely my favorite part. Even now in my fourth year playing, it's still really cool because that's what I grew up watching and always wanted to do. And now I finally get to do it. It's a surreal still to this day. The little kids, they get, they're crazy. They get after it. It's funny too. Yeah, it's just getting them hyped up. And it's hyping us up too when them kids are out there. A program filled with fun traditions and rich in history. The walls, the rafters, even the playing floor tell quite a story. We had a tradition here for over 100 years. Uh, you know, when you look at uh, the state of Illinois and all-time wins is, you know, we have a chance in the next next two years, hopefully, to, to get to 2,000. There's only three other schools uh, in, in, the, in the state of Illinois that, that have that. And then nationally, you know, that, that puts us in the top 10. Old alumni come through, they always talk to us. Oh, we need to do better, what we can improve on, and uh, it's really nice getting input from those guys. Pigneyville is ranked second in the state in Class 2A. Ask the players, and they'll tell you there's a special responsibility you have when you put on that Panthers uniform. We've had, what, 57 some odd regional titles, so there's a lot of good teams, a lot of great teams come through here, and you know that, um, that you want to be one of those teams. The Panthers have won multiple tournaments this season have only two blemishes on their resume. But that 19-point loss at Nashville on January 10th still stings. Definitely. That week of practice after woke us up, too. <laughs> Things that came really easy to us. Uh, you know, I think that, you know, we, we had ran, ran through most teams we had played. We had not had much of a challenge. You know, we've had running clock in, in 15 of our, of our 23 games. Uh, you know, so I think that was an eye-opener. There's a different way to play. Uh, teams are going to give you your best shot every night, and you can't just show up, and you're going to have to, you know, really compete. But this is a veteran group, and it starts with Dawson Yates. He just needs 30 more points to move into second place on the school's all-time scoring list. Everyone cares for each other. Um, we're not selfish at all. Everyone would rather make the extra pass to get the person that extra shot. It's a really good group. We just got to communicate together and get close together and then be ready to go. Here soon, I think we can reach our full potential and put on a full 32 minutes.